Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Uh, as you can see, we've been making a bunch of mods to the truck and looking at different camping gear. So I figured I'd go ahead and fill you guys in that I'm going on a road trip. This road trip is going to consist uh, of going down through Florida and meeting up with a few people. The people that I have lined up are gonna be Thomas the Trail Engine, and he's gonna be in Alabama, and then we're gonna go down to Florida. And in Florida, uh, Mr. Tonka and Clint Gibbs. So I have a lot of friends in the Miami area. We can go ahead and knock out a few things down there as far as, I think there's Jonathan Dickson, Dickinson Park, the Grapefruit Trails, um, Alafaya is going to be, you know, first of Tonka, Virginia Keys, Markham Park, I'm probably gonna get under the keys as well. Hopefully you guys like the update and everything that we have going on. So we got a bunch of surprises ahead, so stay tuned. I got the rack mounted up. Pop this thing up. And what I've got is the pop-up tent on one side having the same height as these bins. So it's pretty level. It's about almost exactly what it would be if you actually built a platform. And then it leaves my entire back seat open for any kind of bins or storage back here. So a couple of the products that we'll be going over on the trip is that I have got the camper shell that I got put on. I've got the foam mattress that I created a platform mattress situation out of. Turned out pretty well. The Reflectix, go over that stuff. We also can go over the idea of snacks and food, how I'm gonna cook, how I'm gonna stay dry, what I'm doing for my camera setup, uh, what I'm gonna do for Wi-Fi, bunch of these questions and things that people have going on that I, I'm gonna do my best to answer. And these are a few things that I've just kind of pre-game thought they're gonna be important that I wanna go ahead and jump on top of. I still haven't figured out the bathroom situation all the way, but in time I'm sure I'll figure that out as well. I went ahead and outfitted the truck with a camper shell, the Overland Series cap. I also added a carpeted LED lights and I also with a bag rug to just as far as be a layer of insulation in the back of the truck. I'm a pretty warm person. I'm not saying the cold doesn't get to me because the cold gets to everybody at some point, but I usually can be a little bit ahead of the game with staying warmer longer than most people or some people or whatever. I'm, I'm really hot nature person. So not too worried about uh, getting too cold because I have a five degree sleeping bag and I will have insulation and Reflectix inside the cab. And I think I might even put some underneath the bed on the platform, but we'll see how that goes. So a couple of things that we're gonna do along the way is we're gonna be meeting up doing collaborations with other uh, YouTube mountain bikers, riding more trails, figuring out and diving in a little bit more to the camping situation. Uh, go ahead and got a tent set up and I've got a couple ideas of how things are gonna work now and what I think is the best move for a simple platform and a sleeping situation, staying warm, sleeping bags, the whole nine yards. I'm just gonna jump in, go for this road trip, and I'm out for some adventure to meet some new people, check out some new trails. I'm super excited to meet up with Thomas the Trail Engine and Clint Gibbs and Mr. Tonka. And going down to Florida, I'm gonna to get to hit some of the trails that uh, were right by where I used to live, but I wasn't into mountain biking at the time. So I'm looking forward to that. Mark and Parks, they have a good sized jump section now as well, which will be really fun. And I met a few people, actually, I met some people at Bailey and Windrock that are from that area. So I look forward to going there and checking those guys out. So along the way, we're gonna have to figure some things out. Uh, the, we're gonna have to figure out some camping, some fire starting, cooking meals while out camping, truck camping, the boondocking, figuring out where to shower, figuring out um, places to stay, the schedules going on. It looks like I have like a month long schedule. What we've done is we have Velcroed the S-Works tarmac to the back of the... So we are inside the camper shell now. Uh, trying to get tucked in. It's definitely a lot closer in here than I thought it would be. But so here's the first night in the camper shell. See you in the morning, we're gonna hit Chewbacca. Cool. First night of the truck. I only had one sketchy thing happen after parking in a sketchy area at a church. Had some people stop, started to look at the truck, set the alarm off, and I reparked at a Sam's Club, and I had no problems. So, lots of lessons learned on the road. Hey, hey. hey I'm gonna need to see some ID. Oh, <laughs> a little happy girl. Like so I took one part of the section, put it flat for my legs to be on, put it up there to like a couch, 
and you can't see right now, but there's gonna be a fire right there somewhere in a minute. 